All right, what's up, guys? So Bungie Leaks on Twitter just put out something last night that I thought was pretty interesting that I wanted to make a video about. Um, I normally don't really make too many videos about leaks and stuff like that, but this is something really cool that I thought I would love to share with you guys if you haven't already seen it. Um, a few things to take note before I get into this. Uh, he even posted here, as you can see, was debating on posting this, but the hell with it. So don't actually take this as guaranteed stuff. Although Bungie Leaks in general has been pretty credible and pretty accurate when it comes to leaks prior to the actual like you know season or expansion leak or coming out. Um, so like I said, take this with a grain of salt, but I do want to go over some things in this that uh, I find pretty cool. So let's just get right into it. So we'll start off with some weapons here. Um, so it looks like, from what you can see here, uh, the Reckoning may be making a return as an activity. I don't think it would be the seasonal activity, um, but I do believe that you know that if they were to bring the Reckoning back, it would actually be really cool. Um, I doubt it would be the seasonal activity, although you know, who knows, Bungie can always you know reprise whatever the hell they want. But uh, I think that um, this you know leak coming out right here, I think this m is pretty credible. Although you know there's no way to tell. Like I said, take it with a grain of salt. But let's go over uh, what it has. So it has some taken weapons, which this looks like the old Gambit sniper, which I forget what that's called, uh, with the taken ornament kind of on it. And then look at this. This looks like spare rations, um, which makes me really excited because spare rations used to be my favorite hand cannon when that was still in the loop pool. Um, that'd be really cool if they brought spare rations back. I don't know if you guys saw. Um, and I think it was the Vidoc before Lightfall just dropped. They did have a picture. It was for, I think, half a second of a Warlock. Um, it was like a 3D model Warlock holding what looked like the spare rations. And now that this leak's coming out, for me, that just kind of confirms it. Because Bungie showed that in their Vidoc. And now we're getting leaks that spare rations may be coming back. Um, you can see there's some weapons here. Uh, I'm not going to go through all of them. Because like I said, this could be true, untrue. But, you know, there's some cool weapons, some stasis, some strand weapons coming with it. Let's go on to the next one. This is the big one for me and the reason I wanted to make this video. So this comes from Freezing Dart. Oh, sorry. This comes from Freezing Dart um, and the Bungie Leaks Twitter. And this post is essentially saying that the entire gear score power level system is getting reworked. Um, now, this is a bold, bold, bold thing to post because um, this is essentially the fundamental uh, aspect of destiny 2 destiny in general it's always been this way so the fact that a leak is coming out saying that this entire system is going to get reworked and it's going to go from power level to gear score um or well it says gear score is seemingly gone um levels range from 1 to 100 you can complete weekly seasonal challenges to get power the harder the challenge the more power you get one two three power power is account based instead of character based which would be huge i'll get into that in a second um, and then because if you are 57 power and all of your friends are sub 40, then the game will use the highest power level for everyone that I'm not too sure about how I feel. If that ends up being true, that might be not so great for taking, you know, maybe your new light friends in on, you know, activities or more challenging activities, stuff like that. But, uh, overall, this is looking pretty cool. The fact that they're going to completely, or they, sorry, potentially allegedly are going to rework the power leveling system. That's crazy. Um, and if that happens in a season, that might be the best season we've ever got um, because this is all looking to come out next season. Um, let's go over the next one. Season 21, Bungie won't give me a glaive. Oh, this is just it seems. Trials is getting an arc adapted glaive and the dungeon is getting a stasis wave frame breach launcher, which that would be insane. Solar rapid fire glaive. Okay, edge of concurrence. Solar aggressive SMG, stasis aggressive rocket launcher. Above is the origin trait. Um, we'll go, I think, right here. Uh, no, I don't think uh, gives us that. But uh, yeah, let's go over the last one here. This one's kind of small, so I'll try to read this one. So it says Reckoning Weapons, again, is the top left one with all the Reckoning. Stuff like that coming back. Spare Rations is in there. Um, it says Crucible, Randy's Throwing Knife is coming back, which would be pretty cool. Um, I actually didn't really use Randy's Throwing Knife that much. I always thought it was, you know, kind of just like I hate scout rifles in PvP personally. Um, even for PVE. But that'd be cool if Randy's Throwing Knife came back. That'd be really cool. And then this is another big one, and I know you can't really see it because of how small it is, but it says that Last Wish uh, last wish is up for the uh, craftable, uh, is up next for the craftable raid weapons. So that means they're going to make all of the Last Wish guns craftable, um, which would be pretty sick. I think it's not the last raid, or maybe it is. 
no, it's not the last raid. Garden's the last raid uh, after that that wouldn't have any craftable weapons. But the fact that Last Wish may have some craftable weapons next season is crazy because the first thing I'm going to go do is get the Chattering Bone crafted because I love that pulse. And if you can put, you know, enhance like Feeding Frenzy, oh, it's going to be crazy. Um, but yeah, there's some other uh, leaks in here, um, you know, an emblem stuff like that. I won't go over every single thing, but I thought I'd make a video uh, about the whole power leveling thing and some weapons coming back because I thought that was the most interesting one. Um, that would be so wild if the, uh, if the whole power leveling system got changed. Who knows if these are true? Although, like I said, Bungie Leaks is a semi-credible source. He's gotten a lot of things, he or she, I don't actually know uh, if I'm being honest, but they have gotten uh, a lot of things right in the past. Um, and I look forward to season 22 next season, season of the deep, um, or sorry, season 21. And then, yeah. So I look forward to a uh, season of the deep and, uh, I am very, you know, excited, hoping some of these leaks are true, but yeah, let me know what you guys think about it in the comments. And, uh, yeah, that's it for today's video. All right. Bye guys.